you seem you seem like very concerned of you like and, and your your music you express it through your music that's what i'm trying to say yeah. um you, you seem very concerned about being politically correct in every in like a lot of the stuff you do well why why is that uh, it, it's less about political correctness. It's I realize I come from a place of privilege, you know, the blonde hair, blue eyes, white guy in the south of all places. Um, and it's less about not wanting to offend anyone. It's more I realize I, I want to carry myself with respect. I want to respect other cultures. I want to respect things that even if I don't understand it. And so I try to make corrections where I can, like, uh, I, like I talked about on TikTok, like doing your remix for uh, Holocaust, that was a, initially very a little nerve wracking for me, right? Because again, the, it's called Holocaust, even if it has nothing to do with it, it, it carries that implication with it, whether we want it to or not. And so I wanted to be able to do justice to something like that, right? And so I wanted to have someone in the room who could correct me. And luckily, I know many Jewish people; they're amazing people to be around. And so I consulted them before I did anything, and I try to do a similar thing. I at least try to do my research. Right, gotcha. Yeah, I, uh, I, I that was really surprising to me because, like, when I was making the song Holocaust, it didn't even like occur to me that like I'm I'm a non-Jewish person making a song called Holocaust. You know, it didn't even. I guess because I just wasn't really thinking about that. You know, yeah, and particularly. It, I wasn't. Yeah, I'm not trying. To, I wasn't trying to like yeah. disrespect any culture or anything. But I, it, I just, it's, it's just kind of like, not what you do in the scene, but like you, you kind of just, you know, like, like, oh, this is a song called Holocaust. I, sh- I, this is the, na- this is nasty shit. Like I should listen to this. You know what I'm saying? Yeah, and we both come. I feel like I'm comfortable in saying we both come from fairly privileged positions. We're both white, and we're both men. Uh, at least to some extent, or were at least perceived as male. <laughs> and so we have those blind spots, and those blind spots can cause problems. Uh, if they still cause problems, you see, like, old actors, something they did uh, 40 years in the past or whatever, like, mm-hmm. there's no justifying it. Like, even if they had no ill intentions, it's still a blind spot for them culturally. And I, I know at the end of the day, I can't eliminate all my blind spots. But I try the best I can to sort of have people not look out for me, but be able to learn and keep an open mind and be aware of where I'm blind about stuff. Okay, I see. Gotcha. 